They took our beautiful bench. <laughs> this is where we waited for Jesse to come before we attacked them. So we got here with 10 minutes to spare, and we had to plan our escape route to survey the land. His building is actually right here, right above the stairs that we're going to attack him at. We made sure we got there at 2 AM, sharp. On the dot. On the dot. We had no phones because he did not want us to bring any phones. He said, so we don't lose them. I don't know if that's really the reason, but you can deduce your own reason. So 2 AM, he was nowhere to be found. He was not there. So we were like, damn, what do we do? We didn't have no way of contacting him. He had no way of contacting us. So we waited here for about, what? Four, four minutes. It was about four, minutes, four minutes, minutes, but it felt like forever. Because it was cold as balls. So I saw him out the corner of my eye, and I was like, OK, that's him. Let's go. We got to go get this empire. Yeah, that's him. That's him. Is that him? That's that neck. It's that neck. Get that let's neck. Go. Oh, he's moving fast. Come on, let's get him. Get that neck. Let's get him. As we crossed the street, we said, hey, to get his attention. Hey, Nick. Hey. He turned around, looked at us, and that's when we started yelling uh, the famous slurs he wanted us to yell. Hey. Aren't you that empire hey, the Empire fat Nick. It's MAGA country. Yeah. And then he said, what did you say to me? And then that's when I threw the first punch at him. I held the blow, because I didn't want to hurt him, of course. So I made it look real, but I held it. Then we started tussling, moving, moving around, and then I threw him to the ground. He wanted it to look like he fought back. That was very important for him, because he said, hey, don't just beat my ass. Make it look like I'm fighting back and whatnot. So we did that, and then I threw him to the ground. And while after I threw him to the ground, I, he had no bruise. I wanted it to look more real. So then I threw him to the ground. After I threw him to the ground, I used my knuckle and gave him a noogie. So I went like this. Why did I do that? To give him a scar, to give him a mark, to make it look real, like he really did get his ass beat. After I did that, I fake kicked him. I don't know what he was doing. I wasn't paying attention. That's where I came around with the bleach, the infamous bleach in the hot sauce bottle, poured it on his shirt. Then I finally put the rope around his face. I did not put it around his neck. I just placed it on his face, and that's when we took off.